The students from the drama department at Northeast High School have a show to prepare for, and they're not going to let an auditorium fire or this small cramped room keep them from rehearsing. The kids have really stepped up and held each other together through this. At first glance, the 800-seat auditorium looks ready to go. But a closer look backstage reveals the evidence of the electrical fire that started in the middle of the night nearly a week ago. It was the overhead sprinklers running for several hours that caused the bulk of the damage. It makes me really sad because this was a home. <laughs> this was a home to me and a bunch of kids. And it's kind of like having your house burned down. Senior Andrea Hendricks is a stage manager. Seeing the light grid now ruined by water and the stage floor warped beyond repair is hard to accept. I've been with this stage, with this theater for four years, and it's pretty much gone for my senior year. Come on, guys! Facial! Yeah. Drama teacher Christiana Geisler oversees the preparations in this undersized room. She's amazed by her students' ability to adapt. They're incredibly resilient. Their fall Starshine production was scheduled to open tomorrow night in the auditorium. Now it's been delayed until December 1st and will be held at Meadowlawn Middle School. But for the Northeast High Drama Department, there are limitations to what they can accomplish on their own. We don't have a space for our spring musical. We have nowhere to rehearse it. You know, we're just without spaces to perform in. Since we don't have a lot of money, that's obviously our, our big issue. They're hoping that the community can come forward and help with a venue and rehearsal space for their productions. Challenges aside, there's a common theme among these students. The show will go on. In St. Petersburg, Brad Davis, ABC Action News. If you'd like to help out the drama department at Northeast High School, just call the school at 727-570-3138.